What's going on guys? We have two Sean's here. <laughs> What's up guys? What's and up? we are at a really cool facility being built right now. Holy crap. How long is this going to take to build? Uh, a year from start to finish. Jeez, look at this. This is awesome. So uh, I wanted to show you guys what one is like being built because this thing is amazing. It's going to be three stories, right? Yeah. Yes. Man. All right. So let's walk around and show people. Before we do, what company is building this place? Perlo. Perlo. Do you guys do a lot of these storage facilities? We do. Actually, for the last two years, we've been, that's been, uh, we've done quite a bit. Yeah. Uh, I, it's funny. Like this is the one business. that's kind of like liquor stores. It's always going to be storage <laughs> facilities, right? Yes, sir. All right. You, you're the one taking me around here. Where can we go to show these people? Now, obviously there's nothing in here guys, but look at this. This is crazy. How many people does it take to build one of these? Do uh, you have on site? I mean, the general contractor, we have about four or five people uh, full time, uh, but there's about six different subcontractors huh. uh, and they've got their own crews. Ah, uh, so. The framers have about 13, all the way up to 19 guys. So it looks like this is gonna be where the elevator is gonna be. Yes, that's yeah. your elevator shaft. We got and then. These are going to be climate controlled, looks like, probably. They are, everyone except for the exterior units. Wow, this is crazy. This is the elevator, guys. Man, unreal. So do you guys just do this, or is there any other stuff that... No, uh, we do all commercial construction. Do you mind, can we go in here and check this out? Yeah. Don't worry, I... Wow. Oh, don't worry, I'm... Your boy Wade he used, to, he used to do a little bit of this uh, party plank and... Roofing. I was never any good at it though. Wow, this is crazy. So these are pretty much all done. You just gotta put the Correct. doors get, on them. Yeah, they, they get the burglar bars that go across the top. Wow. They'll get the doors and they'll get framed in. It'll only be eight foot high wall of doors. And then this is, uh, this is crazy. Yeah. This is awesome. What made you guys want to do construction? In the family? I didn't want any student loans. <laughs> <laughs> there, this, see, that's why I teach people how to do storage units. You, uh, it's just one way you can pay for your, uh, for life without going to college, you know. And make a good living. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Wow, this is cool. So there's no power. But hmm. so yesterday we just put in a 17-hour day. We, we poured uh, 25,000 square feet of concrete on the Jeez. third floor. So there's there's over a million pounds of um, concrete on the two floors above us. A million pounds. Wow. Where's the, okay, I guess there's, that's where the structure's at right there that keeps the. That's the elevator yeah. Uh, yeah. There's gonna be two restrooms right here. Ah, uh, wow. And you guys do a few of these a year then? Uh, correct. I think we, we, all around the Portland metro area, we probably have six going in right now. Wow. Yes, yeah, the, the funny thing that I learned about storage units is primarily you think it's people that are in apartments, but most people have storage units are people that have houses with garages. They just have so much stuff. You know, oh, this is crazy. Hopefully this gives you guys a good idea what it looks like one being built because this is incredible. It's kind of eerie a little bit though. You can hear it. <laughs> All right. It's quiet on the inside. Yeah. On the yeah. So this, so these are insulated then it looks like. Correct. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, there's an insulating, an insulating layer all the way around the perimeter. Wow. So they'll be climate controlled in the middle. Wow. How long have you guys been doing this for? I know you would, how long have you been in the construction? Uh, I've been in the construction about uh, 16 years. Wow. So this is the, this is probably the outdoor units, right? Correct. This yep. will be a one story uh, section. Wow. So they put insulation in there, guys. So it's insulated. Wow. Uh, this is incredible. How do you get up top? Is it a... Uh... You want to go up there? Yeah, would it be cool? Yeah. Would you guys? We have to go around. We can go okay. around to the okay. Wow. I wonder how much it costs to build this sucker. Gotta be a lot of money, right? 15 million. Oh my gosh. Wow. That's incredible. That's a lot of concrete too, look at that. Then you got over here, this is probably gonna be what? Outdoor, probably where they put all their... There'll be two drive up uh, buildings as well. Oh, drive yeah, up, yep. All single story. Right wow, is this uh, extra space storage moving in? It is. Yeah, I buy a lot of their units. <laughs> yeah, they, they have some good units up. Wow, and there's some more drive up over here, guys. You got 
outdoor. A lot of businesses go up to the outdoor units because they're drive up, easier access. Correct, they're not climate controlled, but they're yeah. easy access. Yeah, no climate controlled. Wow, this is incredible. Guys, thank you so much for showing everybody. Some people are gonna be interested. You can go, almost go ghost hunting in here without no lights, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, the only bad part though is you're out here in the weather, right? Working, right. but not too bad if you're moving around. Yeah, I mean, we've, we've been lucky this year with, with good weather. Yeah, yeah, that's one thing about Oregon. Are you guys from Oregon? Yeah. Yeah. I've been here for about 13 years. Yeah, so you've been here a while, huh? Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, rain, rain, and more rain. Yep. <laughs> out of the year. How do you, you can't pour concrete though when it's raining, right? Or do you? You gotta pick and choose your weather. Okay. Yeah, you gotta yep. get it in between. Yep. Yeah. All right, looks like we're going up this yeah, bad boy here, huh? Yep. We're all the way to the top. All right, let's go and check this out. Oh, this is incredible. You can see the story there. Uh oh, I hope nobody's afraid of heights. <laughs> okay, okay. And now we're up top. Wow. So this is a uh, you're no joke. You're not no, no joking. This is a lot of concrete, huh? Yeah, wow. Yesterday. 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 Holy crap! Uh, let's go over here and see what it looks like. See, so put a rebar down. Looks like. Yep. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. All the rebar ties all the all the all the yeah, sheer map, sheer walls together, and then we get to put our wire the mesh down. The tower all the way wow. Down the That's incredible. So you think probably another six months or so you'll have this place done? June 1st. June 1st, everybody's gonna be moving in. And you can see how it's close to the freeway, guys. Wow, this is incredible. Dang. It's all gonna be storage units right here. This is gonna be potential money right here, guys. We don't like people losing their storage units, but <laughs> yeah, it's, it's better than good. landfill, right? Yes, it is. Yeah. So, it's incredible. All right, now let's go down. We gotta watch our step here. And we'll go down over here. Yeah, no joke, poured this recently. Wow. I'm crazy, got my hard hat on. I'm looking professional here, boys. Put me to work. This is all the steel that's going in the building right here. All this right here, wow. So how you lift, you gotta use obviously something to lift this up. This is way too heavy for two or three yeah, people. They're using a 10,000 pound forklift right now. Jeez, uh, okay. Either that or they, they, they bring in their crane. They brought their crane in for the bigger beans, but these are all yeah. the smaller ones left. Wow. And you guys are seriously working 15, 16 hour days, huh? On our four days, yeah. Wow. Our typical days, eight to nine hours. Yeah, that's still a long, that's a lot of work. Heck yeah. You yeah. know, that's, that's a lot of work. Yeah, I, uh, I always tell people to use back braces and stuff because my back was when I was, because I'm 34 and I've been doing this for about 10 years now and moving all this stuff or like really kills your lower back, you know? You guys have any back problems? Uh, I, I, I sit at a desk. But... <laughs> <laughs> oh, the truth comes out over here. The truth. Hey. Yeah, I'm the one with the back problem. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, he's got the back problem for both of us. Yes, there you go. There you go. And then you can see this is half the half the walls up. Oh. These are mon monster units. Jeez, look at that. It's crazy. Wow. Well, guys, this has been interesting. This has been a great tour. It, it's been promoted by these guys right here. And uh, two or three a year, that's incredible. So, you can see here. Man, I am a little afraid of heights too, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but I'm gonna edit that out. No, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what is this guy used for? Is this, uh, yeah, oh, that's, that's the- 10,000 pound force. Okay, that, that's what they're putting geez. the beans up with. I bet that thing costs over 100 grand, right? Well, pretty expensive. Definitely. Yeah, wow. All right, guys. 
Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Seriously. Yeah. And uh, this has been the tour. Hope you guys liked it. All right.